Hi guys! So, before I get started, let's address the fact that I sound like a man. I'm sick. I know you guys have been watching videos, but they were pre-filmed on Friday because I felt like I was getting sick. So, I'm sorry. I know I sound terrible and it's going to get progressively worse the more that I talk. So, by the end of the video, I'm going to sound like... What's that guy that does those commercials and his voice is real deep? I don't know. Oh, James Earl Jones. Is that his name? I don't know. Anyway, I'm having a day. I did my makeup and got the bright idea to attempt false lashes, like a full strip. I don't do full strip lashes because I suck. But, you know, I'm like, I can do it. Everybody else does it. They just pop them on and they look perfect. So why can't I? Well, 20 minutes later, I had taken half of my makeup off because I got lash glue. I mean, I could tell you the story for an hour. It was a disaster. I looked like a five-year-old playing in mommy's makeup. There was lash glue everywhere. So I had to take half of my makeup off, redo it, and then I turned my camera on to film and both of my batteries were dead. This is my day, people. But that's not why we're here. We're not here to talk about my trials and tribulations. <laughs> we are here to talk about these little guys. Essie's Winter Collection. Do you guys think I'm going to love it or do you think I'm going to hate it? I'm just curious. Put it down below before I tell you guys. This is it. Winter right here. See them? Winter. So I have five of six shades. There is like a whitish one, like an off-white one that they didn't have, so I didn't get it. And to be honest, I'm really not that, like, dying for it. So I have these guys. We're going to talk about them. I'm wearing one of them right now. This one is gorgeous. We might as well talk about that one first. So this is Jump in My Jumpsuit. Now, Essie does really good red polish. They always come out with good reds. The formulas are always very nice. This one's no different, but the formula is a little odd. It takes a long time to dry in between coats, and it seems thicker than a normal polish. I mean, it was fine. I didn't have any issues with it, but I would allow an extra minute in between coats and try to take it easy with the coats because I noticed, like, as I went on in my manicure, it was getting thicker and thicker. But it was good. I mean, I have it on, no trouble good, gorgeous. Look how pretty it is. And it matches my lips, my lips. Okay, the next one is Double Breasted Jacket. This is my favorite one. This formula is perfect. Really smooth and creamy and nice and opaque. This color is so beautiful. I wanted to put this on again last night. I had to stop myself because I wore this for like four days, like two days ago. Um, I bet that was a nice face that I just made, wasn't it? This is just gorgeous. It reminds me of Rose Hill. I know there's a lot of things that remind me of Rose Hill, but let me grab it. Okay, so this is Rose Hill. Look at that. They're like the same color. It's that like almost red with a little touch of pink. Love. I'm going to wear this combo together. Um, so yeah, definitely my favorite one if you're into reds or like... It's not a true red. It's like an off red, like a pinkish red, and I love that about it. Now, this is not very wintry, but I don't care. I really like it, and I'm happy with it, and I feel like it's something different for Essie. I don't feel like they have done this color before. I'm happy with it. No complaints. Love it. The next one is Jiggle High, Jiggle Low. That name, that is the best name. I love, love, love the name, but... There's always a but. Now, first off, looking at this in the bottle, it kind of looks like Beyond Cozy, which was out, was it a year ago? Um, this is pretty. Like, in the picture I'm going to show you, it looks beautiful. But in person, it's kind of streaky. And it, I feel like they were almost there, but they stopped short. Like, it was almost there, but it's missing something. It's missing, like, bigger pieces of glitter, maybe. I don't know, but the formula is okay. I didn't have any issues with it. It is streaky, like I said, but it applied fine. It was opaque in two coats. I just don't love it the way that I want to. Um, so, it's okay. 
in pictures I think you can make it look really pretty like it photographs really well but in person it's not as pretty as it looks on camera if that makes sense probably not I'm high on cold medicine the next one is bump up the pumps who named these polishes because I would like you to be the namer of my what where I nothing I have nothing I've got absolutely nothing bump up the pumps this one again now this is not very wintry at first when I first saw the collection I was like really that's their winter collection but the formula on this is really good and it's a really pretty color and I feel again like it's unique I don't feel like Essie did this color at least not recently and I mean I can't get mad at it because it's a really good polish nice creamy formula almost a one coater this thing is opaque pigmented beautiful um what I have chosen it for a winter collection probably not I don't know I mean maybe you know what step out of your box instead of wearing colors like this wear this in the winter and be different maybe that's what Essie's trying to tell us I'm not mad at them I know some of you guys thought I was going to go on a total rant but I honestly really like this collection the last one I have is back in the limo this polish needs to go back to the factory to the chemist to the drawing board okay so I put a picture of this on Instagram and told you guys that it was a four coder now let me explain because there's always that one person who shoots you down and they're like it's not a four coder it's a two coder it's not supposed to be opaque blah 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 really you know I did four coats to get it to opacity you don't have to do four coats of it but in order to wear this polish and have it look like this on your nail and to be opaque with no visible nail line you need four coats the formula is not that good it's a jelly polish but it wasn't done very well it's kind of goopy it's kind of thick and it was very very uneven on the nail and a lot of times with jelly polishes they will be uneven but if you put them on very carefully they'll kind of even themselves out this one doesn't do that so you have like one part of your nail that's looking opaque and then you have a huge patch that looks like you put nothing on it that's what I mean by the unevenness so in order for full opacity you need four coats of this which who the hell who the hell has time for four coats I don't and I really don't have much of a life but I don't have time for four coats so if you want something super sheer like a super sheer jelly this might be for you but for what I'm looking for it's not for me girl girls and boys I sound like a monster okie dokes we have not been here that long and I am already finished so thank you guys so much for putting up with this horrid voice hopefully in my next video I will be kind of getting better and sounding like a human um, I love you guys if you've tried any of these polishes let me know down below which one is your favorite I really love the three darker shades um, these two I would pass on especially if you have beyond cozy because this what because the color is similar and the formula on beyond cozy is a lot better and it looks better on so yeah I love you guys so much thank you again for watching I will see you very soon with a new video Mwah. bye let's get that show on the road I should take my show on the road shouldn't I no you should shut your mouth and start filming she thinks she's cute with that red lip she always gets a little sassy when she has a bright lip on take it down because you sound like a man it's a man baby what's happening <laughs> Look at that little zip. <laughs> oh, but look. Yeah, I planned it. I woke up like this. I woke up like this. I don't know. What are you doing to my bed? I don't know. Can I just lay down? No, you cannot lay down while I'm filming. Get lost. Get out of here. Get out of here. Because that's not what happens in life. Like, I'm going to have you sliding around on my bed while I'm trying to film. I'm oh, sorry. You have to go. No. You ain't got to leave, but you got to get that. I love you. I'll be done soon. Okay. Of course, it just breaks your heart. Doesn't break it enough for me to let him in here, though. It, it just, it, oh, I think I need to blow my nose. I don't want to blow my nose. <laughs> oh my god. If anybody's wondering what is on my lips. Oh.
Oh, that was a good sound. It is NARS, Cruella. Oh, did you want to hear more about it? <laughs> Dang, bitches. Google that shit. Bump up the, like, what pump are we bumping up? A breast pump? Bump up the pumps. Like, do you, should you make your heels higher? Are you bumping up, like, a pump? Like, a bump? A pump bump? Pumps in a bump? What? Pumps in a bump. Pumps in a bump. Check the girls with pumps. Give me the girls with the pumps in a bump. Give me the one sec. You know, I'll still say it. It's a good day. Don't hurt the thing. Hi, guys. Oh, it's got a verse, girl. Hi, guys. Wow. Hi, guys. Nope. Mm -mm. Still don't have it. It's too manly. People will be afraid. Think of someone who's tuning in for the first time. Never saw any of your videos before, and the first thing they hear is, Hi, oh, guys. They're out. Like, they're out this bitch. I keep thinking I have freckles. Every time I look in the viewfinder, it looks like I have freckles. Topaz? Do you have freckles? And then this one is double-breasted. 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 Thank God you guys couldn't see that. You are a monster. I am done with this. Done with this. Hey. Everybody has a camel toe. I don't want to hear people say they don't. Put on a pair of leggings, do a couple squats, and then come see me. Welcome to camel toe. I'm the mayor. You took it too far. You're not the mayor. You're the president. I'm not only a client, I'm the player president. Who's that woman that does the, um, how you doing? <laughs> that was terrible. Um, what is her name? Wendy. Wendy. Wendy Wilson? Wendy. Wendy Wilson? No. Wendy Williams? I don't know. Um, there's no point to the story other than I feel like I sound like her. How you doing? That's not how she does it. But that's how I do it. That's the Topaz version. How you doing?